India's deadliest future weapons explained, power of stealth and destruction in its hands. The projects are upscaling the Brahmos missile and co-developing India's fifth-generation fighter aircraft, FGFA. Descriptions of each of the two projects which are being worked upon are given below. Fifth-generation fighter aircraft. 1. The FGFA is being developed by India and Russia. 2. It is based on the Russian PAK FA. The T 50 is its prototype. 3. The PAK FA is a fifth generation fighter aircraft program of the Russian Air Force. 4. The PAK FA lays the foundation for the FGFA, which is being co developed by Sukhoi and Hindustan Aeronautics Limited for the Indian Air Force. 5. The PAK FA is planned to have stealth and advanced avionics. It is a twin engine fighter jet. 6. It is planned for attack missions. 7. The Russian Air Force plans to induct it in 2017. 8. The FGFA will be tailor made for the Indian requirements and will have 40 improvements over the Russian version. 9. India will invest $4 billion to develop the FGFA and wants to produce more than 100 such jets. 10. Russia will share critical aircraft's technologies. 11. Following the joint venture of the Brahmos, India and Russia had agreed to jointly develop the FGFA. 12. Putin also said that India and Russia will work on developing the FGFA. 13. India and Russia hope to conclude negotiations by year end and sign the contract for jointly manufacturing the FGFA. Brahmos. 1. Brahmos Aerospace was formed as a joint venture between Defense Research and Development Organization, DRDO, and Federal State Unitary Enterprise and POM of Russia. 2. Brahmos Aerospace was established in India in February, 1998. 3. Brahmos represents the Brahmaputra and Moskva rivers. 4. It is a supersonic cruise missile that can be launched from a land, air, ships and submarines. It has a speed of 3 Mach. 5. It has a flight range of 290 km now it's double the range to 600 km. 6. It carries a conventional warhead weighing up to 200 to 300 kg. It can also carry nuclear warheads. 7. It has a fire and forget principle of operation. 8. Capable of being launched into Pakistan and China. 9. Brahmos is currently operational with the Indian Navy ships and Indian Army's land-based launchers. 10. Induction of first version of Brahmos weapon complex in the Navy began from 2005 with INS Rajput as the first ship. 11. The Army started inducting the land attack Brahmos Block I from 2007. It has three regiments of the missile. 4th Regiment was approved by the Cabinet Committee of Security last month. 12. It can be launched from underwater as well. 13. Brahmos Air launched version was flight tested on a Su-30 MKI fighter of the EF and up next year. 14. The Su-30 Brahmos will carry out air combat operations within and beyond visibility range. 15. It will provide the EF the capability to attack targets, which are protected by powerful air defense systems. 16. Following the BRICS summit, Russian President Vladimir Putin said India and Russia have agreed to improve the Brahmos missile and will work to increase its range more than 600 km and improved as a carrier killer missile. Thank you for watching. Please share, like, comment and subscribe.